Mexican president speaking right now. That's what we need. We don't have enough trouble. We need him to come over here. Him and Obama get together and think of some more shit they can do. Maybe they'll let some more of these lawyers sue. Have y'all heard about that lawyer that's suing the U.S. government, which is us, the taxpayers, for $25 million for the Mexican kid that was killed while he was throwing rocks at a border patrol. Now, this is a Texas, now I'm going to say lawyer, because an attorney, I think, is a better name. A lawyer, most of the time, is a crook like that one. What does he want to sue us, the taxpayers, when the kid was over there doing something he shouldn't? It's a tragedy. It's a terrible tragedy. But where in the hell were the parents that this 16-year-old was out there doing this? They have no responsibility. Oh, no, just let all of them come over here. Let the drug people come over here and we shoot them in the butt and two of our people go to prison for a year and he gets $90,000. Well, is this lawyer going to sue for the missionary was killed? For the gentleman that was killed on his skiing? No, that's not what that was. It wasn't skiing. He was on a, what do you call those things? You know what I'm talking about. Y'all all know I don't know this newfangled stuff, but that jet ski, that's what it was. They killed him. Then they killed two students. Now they've killed an ICE agent. Now we go over there and help them, but we're not allowed to carry guns. I have news for y'all. We need to stop this crap. We don't need him over here. We don't need anyone else telling us, oh, we're going to do this, we're going to do that. Turn your army loose on those damn drug lords over there and get rid of them so that our people will be safe. And you lawyer, whoever you are in Texas, Why don't you take yourself to Mexico and live over there? Maybe they'll shoot your ass. You sure don't deserve to be living here, getting rich, suing us, your fellow citizens, the taxpayers' money. So, for what? For your pocketbook? You're not doing it for the good of the child whose life was lost because someone wasn't taking control over there, the parents, the government, I mean, those people live in poor conditions. What in the hell are you going to do with their $25 million? You're going to keep most of it. I hope some judge just laughs you right out of court. We need more judges like the one in Florida. He just told Obama's government, yeah, I said the health law was unconstitutional. Now you fast pace it on to the Supreme Court? You want a clarification? Here it is. It's unconstitutional. Deal with it. That's the kind of judges we want. And I hope we get one like that in Texas when these idiot takes a lawsuit. But you know what? That suit will be filed in the United States. Those people will probably be brought over here. And yeah, we taxpayers will have to pay for that. Kind of like those damn nuts that call themselves Baptists out there boycotting funerals. I wish I could have been there. They would have had to put me in jail. I would have taken me up, axe handle, and gone after and gone through all that bunch of idiots. They're not a church. They're not Baptist. I don't even know if they're human, but they are crazy. Oh my God! When are we gonna wake up, and take our world back? I can't do this by myself. I need help. Where are you people? Let's get organized. Let's go out there and stand in front of these people. Somebody pay my way to go to all these events. If I had the money, I'd go. I'm too old now to drive. I figured that out last week. My legs hurt. I don't like to fly, but I'll do it. Let's get something going. Let's stop this crap. Let's go to Arizona. Let's go to Texas. Let's protect our farmers. I mean, they say we can't do it. Well, let's show them we can do it. We won't break the law. But we sure will stand up for our rights. Okay, that's another one of my little rants today. See you later.